Welcome to a new episode of the Amazing Digital Circus. Today, we're going to showcase this universe in the world of Minecraft. Guys, right now, we are about to find out what's here. This is the most mysterious place on the map, and nobody has ever entered here. What do you see there? Tell us, hurry up. It's very strange. I don't even know how to describe it. It looks like a huge head of a stranger from the darkness that has taken over this world. Maybe he's trying to tell us something. I don't want to upset you guys, but I think it's a trap. So let's run away from here while we still have legs to use. Oh my gosh, no, it really was a trap. Oh no, guys, we have to run fast. Let's run, I told you it was a bad idea to come here. Faster, faster, move your legs. Oh, I'm getting dizzy, guys. I don't understand what's happening to me. Oh, I don't understand what happened to me, but let's run, guys. You've changed quite a bit, but let's talk about it later. Faster, faster, let's get out of here before he attacks us. We will never come back here again. Stop, stop. Why do I look like a girl who spent her life in the gym? Of course, I've always dreamed of such a figure, but wait, why did this happen to me? I just passed out and then woke up as a model. I like you even more now. I wouldn't mind asking you out on a date. Many girls dream of such a figure, and you're still complaining now. Apparently, this happened because he wanted to transform you. The spell worked incorrectly, and because you're a real person, you turned into your true self. Oh, so you're such a beauty in real life, I can't believe it. If I weren't a rabbit, I definitely wouldn't let you out of the house. I'll tear your ears off, rabbit. It's good, but anyway, I want to return to my own body. Please, guys, return me to my body by any means. I don't want to be like this anymore. Guys, wait, who is that over there? I can't believe my eyes, it's Zubal. He disappeared many years ago. That unknown person from the darkness took him. Hey, buddy, come on down, we missed you. Your Zubal seems odd, but I suggest we get up right now and talk to him. Maybe he managed to escape and can tell us some useful information. But he clearly isn't himself right now because he looks very suspicious. Guys, let's just be careful because I don't want to fall into another trap. We need to look at everything here so we don't get outflanked. I remember in the last episode, we already bumped into the man from the darkness here. Maybe you will leave my room. Yes, my house is not in the best place, but that doesn't mean you should walk in it. There are still many rooms here, so better let's go into them instead of my house. How greedy you are, Rabbit. We have an important mission here, and you only think about your own house. The last door is open, so I think your friend is exactly there. You know, I would be very careful with him if I were you and wouldn't trust him. Zubal, we haven't seen you here for a long time, buddy. Come out! We missed you. It was so lonely without you. When the stranger took you, we couldn't even believe it. Oh no, I'm afraid your friend is not all right at all. Run faster because right now he wants to shred us to ribbons. You didn't say that your friend has fits of aggression and he runs after people with a sword. Because it's not our friend, but he is controlled by that villain. <laughs> He's running right after us, how fearless he is. So seriously, you gave me a ladder in the last episode to help me, but you didn't think to give me some sort of sword to defend myself. What do we do now? We need to somehow stop him. This is our friend and we don't want to harm him, so we have to run from him. If we harm his shell, then he may die and we'll never be able to save him. Understand that this world is arranged differently and it's infected. Yes, that villain apparently infected him and programmed him to attack us. I know Zubal well and I know he would never do such a thing. But now he is controlled by that villain, so we must run from him. I understand it must be hard for you to lose your good friend. It's hard for me too because I've lost many friends who stayed in real life. Now all my friends are just you and the guys watching our channel. You see, we're just numbers to you. This is a digital circus. If they stop watching us, the energy will disappear and then we will perish. Every time our video is played, we come to life again and it all goes in circles. I understand that it's probably hard for you to believe, but it is really so. But guys, don't relax too much because we are still being chased. So let's put all my affairs and thoughts aside for later and just move quickly on our feet. Looks like we managed to escape. We urgently need to come up with something to stop him. I think he will be back soon, and in that case, we will have to defeat him. Maybe you have some idea how we can stop him. Guys, I have an idea. Let me show you something I came up with. It's truly brilliant. You definitely haven't even thought of this. I built this while you were asleep to tell you about it later. It's truly brilliant. Since I'm an artificial intelligence, I have a lot of information inside me. Yeah, yeah, all your information about how to charm girls. When it comes to something really useful, you can never help. I wonder what you can come up with this time, apart from your genius jokes. 
I'll build a trap we can drive Zubal into. I knew it would come in handy someday, and based on my database, I built it! It's very simple, and at the same time brilliant! The blocks have special magic that won't let them be destroyed! Oh, this is really great news! I think it will help us! I wonder how it will work in action! Oh my gosh! I think now we have every chance to win! I'm sure we can beat him and no one will stop us! By the way, I have a special potion that I found when we were escaping. It's a sleep potion! I think you understand why we need it? I dare say that this potion is needed to first trap Zubal in the trap, and then throw the potion to make him fall asleep. Quite a good plan. I'm starting to like you. I think that apart from threats, you really can't do anything. Well, you really surprised me. Let's run faster. He's chasing right behind us. Now we just need to catch him and throw the potion to neutralize him. Forgive me, my dear friend. I know you don't like to sleep, but today you'll have to. No, I'm alive. Don't worry, it will only be better for him. We will definitely have to come up with something to disenchant her later because I don't know how to do it. You are artificial intelligence. You must know how to do it. It should be in your database. He you can't use the whole database because that stranger has blocked this feature. All right, it's time to use the potion. It's all for your own good. Excellent. The potion worked, and now she's asleep and fluttering her wings idly. I think our biggest difficulty has ended, and now she will sleep for a very long time. I don't want to upset you, but I doubt that this can be done. The spell is very strong, and if we can really disenchant it, it will only be with the help of the villain from the darkness. Maybe we should make a deal with him. This is a very interesting idea. We can indeed argue with him about something. If we win, then he will take and disenchant our friend. And how many of your friends have been enchanted? I want to see them all. Oh, there were very many of our friends, but now they are all enchanted? Although I can even show them to you. We have a special laboratory that we can use. In this laboratory, we can transform into different models. Come on, lead me to this laboratory quickly. I want to transform back into myself. I'm tired of being a model because it's uncomfortable to move so quickly in heels. And I'm also tired of the jokes that you constantly make about me, so I think I'll return to my own body. It's a pity. It was much prettier. Well, okay, let it be. Now we will show you and tell you what this laboratory is. But let Kane do that. Once I restore my database, I'll learn how to make rabbit soup. Okay, so this is a laboratory where we can change ourselves. We can turn into anyone or anything. But first, we need mobs for this. So, in short, we first put mobs there, they transform into a model, and then we can control that model. More precisely, you can control it because you are a real person and you have a virtual helmet. And why do we need a mob if we can just take a model and control it? Wouldn't it be easier to just do it this way and not take life from some mobs? You see? It's an amazing digital circus. We are figuratively in a game. So in order for everything to work, we must give something to get something. That means to give life, you must first take it. Oh, this sounds very sad, but apparently those are the rules. Your digital world never ceases to amaze me. Why is everything so strange here? Oh, there were many unfortunate incidents with our friends. The stranger from the darkness just took our friends and turned them into various monsters. Can't he just break these boards and use the laboratory again? What's so complicated? Just take and break the boards, it seems easy. It's not as simple as you think. Don't forget that this is a digital world, and we, who are in the game itself, cannot destroy blocks. Well, we can, but it's very difficult for us, and we give our energy to do it. Yes, it happened that the villain doesn't have energy, so he can't destroy blocks. Therefore, he will never get his laboratory back as long as it is built up by us. But it seems that in the next episode, we will have to open it again so that you can enter. Yes, because I want to get my beautiful body back without all these unnecessary frills. All right, guys, let's maybe go and have a good rest in the restaurant for now. Good idea, guys. By the way, today I wanted to invite you to my restaurant. Today we have the most delicious menu. I hope that you are already very hungry. Of course you are hungry because all this time we were running away from our crazy friend. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to eat because I'm really very hungry. I'm so hungry I would happily eat a whole mammoth right now. I wonder if there are mammoths in your world. Our world has a lot of interesting things. Oh, guys, problem. The restaurant is closed today. And why did you sometimes invite us here just so we could look at your pretty teeth? Now we have to go fishing to eat at least some fish. I hope that we won't get attacked again by some maniac with a diamond sword on the way. Oh, drop it. It would be good to run around and stretch our legs. 
All right, guys, dear viewers, and everyone who is watching our amazing digital world. Thank you so much for watching. There are many of you, and we love you very much. Yes, yes, hit the like and subscribe to the channel. In the next episode, we will open the laboratory and you will find out what madness is.